So with that little demonstration out of the way, I would like to ask someone, if you're so inclined to do so, a favor. Um, for about four or five years now, I've been making my own homemade black powder to shoot in my muzzle loading guns. And over the course of this amount of time, I've experimented with a lot of different type of charcoal sources. This one was a blend of alder and peanut shell. Yes, peanut shell does work. <laughs> but the alder that I have right now is what they would consider glossy alder. And I'm really looking for some buckthorn alder. So if one of you friends happens to live in an area where you have some buckthorn alder, um, I would be interested in talking with you and making arrangements to get some harvested and shipped to me. You can reach me at, you know, kimmyembrooksgmail.com. And what I'll do is I'll put a link down below um, how to identify buckthorn alder because there is a, another species, as I mentioned, glossy alder. And the difference between the two, as far as gunpowder is concerned, the buckthorn alder produces more gas per, per cubic centimeter than what the other woods do. And so I would be interested in acquiring some so that I could do some experimenting with it on my other channel. So if you could help me out, friends, I'd appreciate it. Once again, uh, I'll give you the email. It's kimmybrooks at gmail.com. And I'll put a link down below so that you can identify properly the alder that I'm looking for. We'll catch you next video. Bye.